so now we will discuss the next tool which is uh, a rectangle tool so rectangle tool we can create shapes so you can see here like uh, the color we can select which we want to fill and this is outline color if we want to select and this is outline size we can select if you press and hold shift that will create a square and without press and hold uh, press and hold shift without press and hold shift you can create a rectangle and then you can see the color we can also apply like here we have some patterns and gradients also we can apply and uh, if you want like uh, the outline so outline also we can uh, change like uh, we have right now this black color I will apply like uh, this color uh, and the outline size we can change and outline styles also different styles we can see now it's like this so we can also apply another so any uh, style you want to apply you can apply to the outline and uh, this one if you select rectangle tool and then press and hold shift and then click on your artboard then this will ask you sometimes like you want to create a hundred by hundred pixels but it is showing points here so what we can do enable rulers and right click and change it to pixels now press and hold shift and click so you can see now it's showing in pixels so for instance I want uh, 100 by 100 pixels so I will write here 100 by 100 and illustrator will create a rectangle uh, a square for me actually um, with the size of 100 by 100 pixels so like this we can create or if you have created so you can also uh, select this one and here you can see uh, the shape uh, width rectangle width like 368 I will apply 300 and you can see this is changing automatically height like if I change 200 you can see it's changing so we can uncheck this option that is called constraint width and height proportions now you can see I will change it 250 and the height will be remain 95 so you can see it's still 95 so we can change it to like uh, 200 so like this we can uh, create rectangle and square shapes with different options and uh, if we want we can also reduce the opacity so that's very easy thank you very much for watching this video